I'm here at the opening night for Te Oha campus. Behind me, a crowd eagerly awaits the arrival of Jacinda Ardern to open Te Oha to the public for the very first time. But I acknowledge the heart that sits uh, in the Wellington creative community and the role that you play and that this particular precinct plays as well. The six-storey Te Oaha campus will accommodate up to 1,000 Weltec and Fitzadea students. With a combination of creative schools all together in the city centre, the opening night showcase gives guests and future students a taste of what to expect from Te Oaha. I'm so excited about Te Aoha. like the amount of different artistic skills are going to be able to collaborate and make weird new stuff right in the middle of Wellington. This yeah. building's amazing. It's so cool, honestly. It's just amazing, this building. Fantastic. Cultural infrastructure is so important. Beautiful, very exciting. It's pretty darned amazing, to be honest. It's better than I thought it would be. You students are going to love it. I'm delighted how everything's gone tonight. I think it's outstanding. Now that everyone's enjoyed all sorts of food and activities, seeing all sorts of performances, we're all waiting outside on Dixon Street to watch the finale, Malia Johnson's Art of Colour Dance. I now announce Te Kahui, Te Arahu, home of the New Zealand Institute of Creativity, open. Woo!